But first, why an ambitious drought relief plan in the North Bay could be sidetracked by royalty. Good evening, I'm Alan Martin. And I'm Elizabeth Cook. As Marin County sinks deeper into the drought, local leaders are considering an expensive solution, desalination plants. KPIXY's Wilson Walker with details on why the plans could put Marin in an unusual bidding war. Wilson? You know, this desalination, an idea that surfaces every time a drought comes around, often to get shelved as soon as the drought goes away. Well, here we are with Marin once again considering pulling water from right here out of the bay. So we, we previously looked at a permanent desalination facility uh, back in 2010, and it would be placed down in San Rafael, close to the bay and by the Central Marin Sanitation Agency. As the water levels continue to drop in Marin County's reservoirs, more options are being put on the table in the event of another dry winter. Now, Plan A continues to be an emergency pipeline over the Richmond San Rafael Bridge. That project is a priority because it would bring us a larger volume of water that more closely meets our demand needs. We're looking at desal as a secondary backup option. A backup option because it provides less water at greater cost. The mobile desal units being considered are in high demand around the world. The crown prince of Saudi Arabia even shopping for some for his own project. But the district is talking with three different companies and they're confident they'd be able to make a deal if it becomes absolutely necessary. And everyone here knows that drastic measures may not be far away. No, absolutely. I mean, everybody's keenly aware of the situation, and all of us in Marin County have cut back on water usage massively to the point where there are really very few further cuts that one can make. Without rain, time is running out for what's left in reservoirs like Alpine Lake, whether it's the pipeline, desal, or maybe both. Emergency plans will be needed soon. Well, the, the more successful we are in our conservation efforts, the longer that our existing supplies will last us, which gives us more time to explore these supplemental water projects. All right, uh, the, the, the schedule here, the timeline for these decisions, a, a call on whether or not to to reinstall the pipeline. You saw the picture from the 70s on the on the bridge. That'll come this month, so they're going to decide that pretty soon. And then the next decision would be would be the desal call, making that decision because it takes six to nine months to kind of get that whole thing up and going. You've got a bid. You've got to get the stuff trucked in here and set up and, and get rolling. So uh, there's sort of a, a, a timetable, and then all of that comes with watching the winter and how how much rain we get so you know we get a couple dry months in yeah maybe desal looks like something you're going to need as an auxiliary backup if we have another dry year we're live here in san rafael wilson walker kpix5